Today's video is all about the energy of a wonderfully abundant plant that we all have around us. And that plant is the dandelion, freshly picked from my very abundant dandelion field, the garden. So this video I'm going to dedicate to two people. One is Lucy, a wonderful friend of mine who has been encouraging me to share the fullness of how I see my world from an energy perspective. So I am an energy psychologist, I am an energy practitioner, and I deal with shifting the energetic um, uh, body around you, your energetic body, and how your thoughts and emotions also shape your energetic environment. But of course, we can also shift our energy by what we take in, in our mouth, what we eat and what we drink and the environment, the beautiful environment for me that surrounds us. So Mother Nature is our birthright. It's how we were born to live, living in harmony with the natural world. And I want to today talk about the medicinal benefits of dandelion flowers and how to make dandelion oil, because they are abundant. Many people see them as weeds, but today I want to prove that old adage that the, the things that are best for you, the best things in life are actually free. <laughs> On the whole, I think most of us have got ready access for free to these wonderful flowers. And from an energetic point of view, I've been able to see and hear energy since I was little. That caused me all sorts of problems as a kid when I used to listen to my food, got very messy with spaghetti hoops on toast. But the sound these make is a beautiful harmonious, I can't really describe it, it's like, like a smiling hum, it's just beautiful. And the glow is like the flower, it's golden, like your inner sunshine. For me, this is the energy of your solar plexus, the energy that we have in our third energy center of willpower, personal power, personal strength. If you think about these babies, we can throw weed killer on them, we can chop them down, we can stomp on them, and they still keep coming back. They have enormous, vibrant, thrusting strength. They will always pop up again and again. And that energy is in the plant. It just makes perfect common sense, whether you can see or hear the energy these babies are so good for you. You can literally just, you know, rip off the, the petals and sprinkle them <laughs> over salads, over your veggies, over whatever it is you're eating. They make a be beautiful, um, you know, glow on, um, you know, cupcakes and muffins even. They are so healthy. You can Google how healthy they are, but from the very top of my head, they are full of minerals, potassium, iron, um, calcium. They do all sorts of amazing things to keep your body nutrient dense because these babies are nutrient dense. They're full of vitamin C, that great, you know, vitamin that boosts our immunity. It's great for our skin, full of vitamin K, great for our red blood cells and for our eyesight. They are anti-carcinogenic. They actually prevent the growth of cancerous tumours. They are antioxidants, way more so than expensive drugs and supplements that you might buy. So if you want to slow down the ageing process, if you want to keep your cells healthy, cellular, cellular regeneration, the dandelion has it all. So you can eat them, you can eat the flowers, you can eat their leaves. I steep the whole plant in vinegar, I steep the whole plant in vinegar. Um, I literally dig out the entire root. In fact, I'll show you, why not? Here we are, no expense spent. You can see there the leaves, the whole root. Um, I, I like to do this before the flower has come because the flower makes this little tonic here a bit more bitter, but this is literally the dandelion root cleaned off. You know, I trust the soil in my garden. There's no herbicides, no chemicals in there and you literally cover it to steep in organic vinegar, raw, I use raw apple cider vinegar, and it makes a wonderful liver tonic. It's cleansing, purgative. It really looks after your blood and just cleanses it, gets rid of the toxins. So I literally have a teaspoonful of this in hot water with a little bit of lemon juice. And it's an amazing way to stimulate your digestive system, boost the blood cleansing properties, and get your, you know, your liver and your kidneys 
kidneys into a healthy state because it really looks after them. So that's one way to use. And literally, you pick the whole thing, pour vinegar on it, and leave it to steep for two to three weeks. Hey, presto. You, can't, you are then supposed to um, strain it. This is one that was only a couple of weeks ago, and I haven't got around to straining it all out. It looks prettier when it's strained. But back to the dandelion flower. I have been picking the dandelions and I was going to do this video outside. Sadly, my hand holding with my phone is not very steady and I accidentally unpressed the record button so it wiped the whole thing. <laughs> so here we are inside. Um, I should say that when you're picking these, you only want the head and you will find a little bit of milky kind of, it's some um, latex, that the milky substance, a liquid that comes out of the tubular stem. Some people are mildly allergic to that. Don't worry about it. You can put gloves on if you're at all scared that you might be allergic. And it, it, it's literally, it's hardly even an itchy rash because I have got it myself on occasion when I've overdone this. But it goes in a matter of days. Um, or hours in fact if it's only a tiny one so wear gloves if you're at all worried you put your dandelions just the head in the in the jar I've shaken all of these off to make sure there are no insects don't want insects in there and I'm using a mixture of half um, pure organic rapeseed oil because that's what we have here in Cumbria and also some lovely virgin olive oil and you want to completely cover those dandelions I'm just going to fill it up to the top and there we go, all the flowers are completely covered. Looks beautiful already. I mean, it has that amazing glow, that vibrant, powerful, golden energy of, of life, of willpower, of personal strength. Now, you don't, I've used a kind of an old jam jar. You don't want to put the metal lid on it. I am using a handily ripped off piece of muslin. I have loads of muslin because I'm always doing things in the garden. I use these to wrap flowers and petals and leaves and you put them in the bath and tie it up everywhere. You hold on to it. I use silicon bands, so cheap to buy from Amazon. I'll put some links. Very difficult to do this while you're on camera, but you literally want to put your band tightly. And there we go. We have the elastic band holding down our muslin. I made a bit of a mess of that, but you don't have to. And you literally want to let this seep in the sunshine on a sunny shelf. I put it in my conservatory for a week to a couple of weeks. And you can use this oil in salad dressings. It's best to use it raw because obviously if you're cooking, you'll kill off all of that wonderful goodness. So use it raw in salad dressings, drizzled over your veggies, drizzled over your fish or, you know, some grilled meats on the barbecue. It's absolutely fantastic fantastic and all of the nutrients of that gorgeous golden flower are inside you your energy will be buoyant you'll be radiant you'll be healthy you won't get cancer or it's anti-carcinogenic so obviously aligned with the rest of your lifestyle it is a cancer preventative so there you go the best things in life are free oh and i forgot to say rubbing this oil if you suffer from sore joints over exercise been on a long walk or you've got um, rheumatism arthritis this is a fantastic painkiller and uh, you know rheumatic ease for those sore muscles and joints so literally just grab some pour it into your hand and rub where it's sore and all of that good energy is being received through your skin because this oil goes through the blood brain barrier it's easily absorbed it's bio available it's natural it's free the best things in life are free so i hope you enjoyed that a bit of a left turn at the lights for me but i'd love to share some more of how i see the natural world and its amazing benefits um, like subscribe and share as usual and thank you so much for sparing your precious time and joining me on this journey <laughs>